Hey guys, Dominique Canine Corporation. So this is a setup for Dobermans. My daughter's done a really good job. So you have a, you have the large bed with the side rails. Um, she uses a, a pad underneath there. So Mal's about halfway through. And she's got the pad tied off where it doesn't come loose. Food and water's outside. Duct tape does not work on the pads. Duct tape does not work on the pads. <laughs> So she's going to go ahead and remove some of the puppies so that Mal doesn't step on any. She's about halfway through. So we're going to take a few out. We're going to put them in this, her fancy, now I have my oxygen machine. She has a fancy incubator. And she's going to put them in that's going to keep them warm and relaxed until they're ready. These guys weren't eating, so they weren't, not that anything wrong with them, they just were chill. So it's a two part system that she has. So we the oxygen line right here. Um, typically, you just leave it hanging in here to help their oxygen flow. If you ever have a gasping puppy, you can put this cup over their nose and help them um, with their lung formation. Newborn puppies, we want to kiss this. <laughs> <laughs> They're a little leggier than my dogs and puppies, as you can tell. So, Mal's kind of stalled out. So, I just gave her just a little bump of oxytocin. Hi, oh, Mal, Mal. Take off another one when they're, you know, off and... Those three feeders I'm gonna leave for now. Yeah. Oh, now you're hungry. Well, just because you touched him. Oh, yeah. Mal's a good girl. This is her second litter. So she's kind of got it under control. She's been licking and stuff, so I think we're gonna be going in another direction. Mal's one of the few females I've seen that can actually count and knows when puppies are gone. She is a smart girl. So, um, the pup that you guys see in some of my other videos, Draco, that's his mom. All right, so this is just the option of a second setup. See, she's she's on her second litter. It's my daughter and the dog are on her second litter, so she's building her kennel. So, again, we're still inside. She's just doing this one inside while she's making sure that that uh, she enjoys breeding. So. Is case study number two.